Kelly. And I'm Robert. Today is September 11th, 2015. And, and this, this is... is Could you guys reenact a meme for us? It'd be really cool to know another language, don't you think? Yeah, it would be. I know a little bit of French. Prove it. Yeah? Tu cara es como la luchega. I think it means, how are you? I don't think that's French. Bonjour, je m'appelle Karine, or Carissa. Karine is my French name. I am a junior. Uh, my name is uh, Baltimore Ruiz. I'm in 12th grade. So my name is Shakir Hashmi and I'm in the 12th grade. Uh, French Club is a club where we celebrate the, the, the Francophone culture. Like in our meetings, we watch some French movies, play French games. Sometimes we play Just Dance uh, to, and we dance, along to like, we dance along to like French music or not necessarily French, but just Francophone music. Uh, we've decided the meetings are gonna be the second and fourth Tuesday of every month at uh, 2.20 after school. Well, I'm one of French Club's co-presidents. I've been a member for two, three years now. So I do a lot of coordinating food. Food is always awesome. Can't go wrong there. I like croissants. Baguettes with cheese are always good. Really French stuff, French onion soup. Um, you know, you shouldn't be shy from joining French Club, you know. Uh, we're not going to judge you if you don't know any French, so it's just a really good idea. If you're interested in Francophone culture or you just want food one day, you know, drop on by Portable 7 and have some food or watch some movies and stuff. As a historian, I take pictures and try to record different events that we do and make sure that we continue to be successful and get to meet more people who are interested in learning French. We learn French all the time and we learn new um, ways to communicate, like kind of through slang, and there's also a mot du jour or word of the day. I'm glad school is back, only because of the sports though. Same, did you get to go to any of the volleyball games this season? No, I haven't really had the chance to. Well, they won this week's game. Played Yelm yesterday and everybody beat, uh, everyone won JVC and varsity. We prepared for the season um, by lifting over the summer and playing lots of volleyball and mentally preparing for success. I'm confident about our intimidation factor. Um, I enjoy coaching volleyball because um, the kids are great kids, um, it's a fun sport, and uh, we're successful. We're much taller than we were last year, um, and we're slightly better looking than we were last year. Um, our next home game is against Tahoma on Monday. 5.45 JV and C team, 7 o'clock park. Hey Jacobs. Hi, my name is Cameron. Jay. I'm Diana. I'm a middle blocker on the varsity volleyball team. Um, I play middle. I'm an outside hitter. I'm an outside hitter. I play because I'm tall and I cover the, the position as middle and I started in sixth grade and I guess I never stopped. <laughs> um, I play volleyball just because I'm, I'm pretty big and it's a pretty intense sport and like the energy on the court is just amazing and the bond you build with your team is just great. Why? Freaking smash! Why out? To win. But yeah. mostly smash. <laughs> Why do you win? Because I ain't got nothing else to do. Fine. That's all for this week's episode of Royals Week in Review. I'm Riley. And I'm Robert. Tune in next week for more. Bye. Very concerned about our mismatching sock. We're much taller than we were last year, um, and we're slightly better looking than we were. Menace. Technically, I'm Dennis really the good. Menace. That's what those people call themselves. No, like M E M E N I S T. And, and this, this is Royals <laughs> Weekend Review. I was gonna say John Cena. <laughs> it would be really cool to know the lit. Set up straight. Smile. Three, two, one. Oh. Oh.
Ha, I knew, I knew. Next week for more. Bye. Oh, oops, I'm not sure what was wrong. <laughs> oh, I think we, we didn't cross.